Hello, welcome back. On this episode, problem number three, we're going to talk about uh, a word problem with variables on both sides. All right, and when we have the room and we're, when I give you the write out um, or the handout with the word problem, we, we're going to do some highlighting and underlining. It says that the graphic designer, um, 1.5 hours, takes 1.5 hours to make one page of a website. And using new software, the designer can complete each page in 1.25 hours. But it takes eight hours to learn the software, okay? How many web pages would the designer have to make in order to save time using the software, okay? Now, there's a couple ways that we can talk about and using to model this, all right? We know, we, with the information that we know, we have 1.5 here. We have each page, okay, and then eight hours to make the software, okay? Now we know, what we know is we know that the current time is 1.5 hour per page, okay? We also know time with new software. I just use SW. 1.25 hour per page and time to learn is eight hours okay we need number of pages all right and so in order to plan for this we're going to want to write an equation to solve this, okay? So, we're, and we're gonna relate this by saying current design time is equal to design time with new software plus the time to learn the software, okay? We're going to define, we're going to define, we're going to let P equal the number of pages, okay, the designer needs to make. So now we're going to go ahead and write our equation, which is going to be, we're going to write 1.5p is equal to 1.25p plus 8. Okay, now we can also look at it this as this way. If we had, we know that the total time is going to be 1.5p pages, okay? And we know in the 1.5 pages, we have the 1.25p plus the 8. So that's how we can also think of it in terms of relating it as an equation as well. Now, we're going to combine like terms. There are in, we have a variable here and a variable here. And we have no other constants. Okay? So what that tells me is that I just need to combine my variables. And since they are on different expressions, I'm going to need to make a zero pair. Now, I'm not going to do the 1.5p. I'm going to use the 1.25p because that will put the constant by itself on my right expressions, and then it will put the constants by themselves in the left expression. So I'm going to subtract 1.25p from both sides, and I'm going to write this over here since I'm running out of room. 1.5 minus 1.25 will leave me with 0.25p is equal to 8. I'm now going to divide both sides by 0.25. Which p is equal to 32. So, it takes the designer and the amount of time to make 32 web pages using either software, okay? Now, we haven't finalized the answer because the designer must make one more page than that in order to save time. So the designer would need to make 33 pages to save time using the new software, all right? I will see you in the next video.